and now is, is one more step. This is the hardest one. And uh, we don't know who we're going to play yet, but uh, we know it's going to be tough. But right now, let's enjoy it and uh, all focus on who we're playing later. Yeah, Tony Ron Higgins from Memphis Commercial Appeal. He had like 25 for 26 in the second half. Just talk about the confidence you had, especially when they kept making runs and you just kept making plays like you just, like you felt you could do anything you wanted. Well, my, my teammates, they're doing a great job getting me free, uh, setting great picks, and uh, playing with a lot of confidence. Um, you know, Pop's challenging me uh, every year to, to get better, and uh, I just try to get better every year. And uh, this game, you know, I felt good with my shot. Uh, my teammate was doing a good job to get me open, and I uh, kept knocking down. First of all, how's the eye? Did you? Did it's you okay. Yeah. It's okay. It happens. You know, it's a very physical series, and I know Mark didn't do it on purpose. It was the other one, so yeah. <laughs> Teresa Walker, Associated Press. Uh, Tony, getting attacking Memphis in the paint. You guys got so many easy layups and just kind of dominated them once again in the paint. What was working so well and that allowed you guys to attack that way? Well, I think our uh, ball movement. You know, the first two games, um, we, we moved the ball very well, knocked down a lot of threes, and uh, I think it opened it up for game three and four. They didn't come as much. Uh, they were not committing as much on me when I was penetrating because they were scared that I would hit the shooters. So I think uh, game one and game two definitely opened for, for everything else. And so... Uh, after game two, when I got a lot of assists, I knew they were not going to help as much. And so uh, I was just being aggressive and um, and just try to, you know, take what the defense gave me. Let's talk about the feet of getting back after you've been gone for so long. You guys got to so many so fast. And then just yeah, it's an it's, it's, it's unbelievable feeling. You know, it's really hard to, to go to the finals, to win a championship. And for me personally... I was 21 when I won my first one, and you think it's easy, and you're gonna go back <laughs> every year. And and um, 2007, we will win our, our third one in five years, and you think it's gonna keep coming. And I'm 25, and and six years goes by, <laughs> and every year it gets tougher and tougher. Uh, every team wants to beat you, and that's why it makes it even more special to to go back after all those years, being playing at a high level with the same coach with the same big three, but, you know, changing a couple of pieces, huge pieces like Kawhi and then Danny Green playing great basketball, Matt Bonner, Chago Splitter. And so uh, it, it, I think it makes it even more special. And uh, if we go all the way, he'll definitely be my, my favorite because it gets harder and harder. The last time your team was in the finals, you ended up being the finals MVP. How, how do you think you have changed, your game has changed since in those six years? So. Well, I think I'm improving every year. I try to improve in every aspect of the game. Uh, try to be good defensively, uh, offensively, be the engine for the team. Uh, try to be a better passer, better shooter, uh, better free throw shooter, and a better uh, clutch uh, performer in the fourth quarter. And, uh, you know, it's an honor to, to be, um, you know, the, the guy for, for a franchise like the Spurs. And, and you got Timmy and Manu and all my teammates, they're counting on me. And, and Pop shows so much uh, confidence that it makes me want to, you know, play play great, and and uh, that's why my my teammates they they, they push me to to get better.